everyone! I am bored today, so I said why not film a natural, not natural at all, but natural for me makeup look. Uh, right now in New Zealand we are in quarantine, we can only go to the supermarket for Eve. And I love doing my makeup, so I just thought that it would be nice to show everyone a little bit of a makeup look to just treat yourself and go to a supermarket like this. I don't know. It just makes me feel nice when I do my makeup. I thought that it would be nice to teach whoever watches this what works for me, what makes me feel good and pretty and yeah. So this is the tutorial. Hope you like it. <laughs> Alright, so first we're gonna use a facial moisturizer. I use the Glow Lab. I think it's a Zealand brand. So we're gonna put that on our face. After that, primer. I use the Benefit Pore Professional. It makes my skin feel so much smoother, easier to apply the foundation after that. After the primer, I go with the foundation. I use... How do you say? La Roche-Posay. La Roche-Posay? Posay? Um, <laughs> I've been using this foundation because it makes my skin feel so much better. It's healthier and it feels better. Just this much, put it all over my face. I just do circles so it just blends easier. You can use a sponge, whatever is easier for you. Because I live in New Zealand, I usually like to feel like I'm tan, especially right now that it's summer. So what I use is the Neutrogena Bronzer. This is number 30 Sun Kiss. So what I recommend you to do is uh, to make a number 3 or an E first on your cheek and then a number 3. After the Neutrogena Bronzer, I use the Hula by Benefit Bronzer. This is a little bit darker. It makes your face more defined. It depends what you like. I like it like that, but you can just use the first bronzer and that's it. So a little bit on the forehead. After that, I use a uh, blush. It doesn't matter what color, you can use peach blush, you can use a pink blush. Easy trick is when you don't know where to put your blush, you just smile like this and you just put it all over here. Alright, eyebrows. Recently I tried, I don't know the name, this is the benefit eyebrow things erased. I wish I could say it, but it really works. You can use whatever brush you have, whatever you, you like. So it has a little bit of a color. I use a light brown shade. I'll just do whatever, honestly. I don't have a technique. I just like up, 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 up. I just don't really care about my eyebrows, to be honest. So I just do whatever. I'm filming! Up, up, up. Same on the other side. So after. Hi, oh, Maya! <laughs> Shut up! Or the base of the eyeshadow, I use Hula Bronzer. So that basically makes a natural bronzy color, which I like. Just put it on the crease with a blending brush. And I just grab a clean brush and I just blend it all over my lid. It just makes it way smoother. Then I grab a natural color. I'm using the Naked Two palette. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> so I'm gonna be using a natural color. So uh, just for the base, I'm just putting it on the inner corner of my eye. Instagram what your are doing. Yeah. So what I'm gonna recommend is to put either another color if you want a darker color or you just want to just change a little bit. This is my everyday look. So if you want to change a little bit, I would highly recommend to use a brown color here. <coughs> okay. <laughs> So when you use another color and you want to keep it natural but you want a little bit more makeup, uh, just put on a little bit of a darker color on your blending brush 
and then just put it only here, not here, only here. So it makes your eye have a little bit of a depth. Just blend it again with the clean brush just to blend <laughs> things. Alright, that's just a little bit of a lighter color. Just put it here just to have everything kind of like it. Uh, I wouldn't recommend to use a dark color because it kind of looks like you're, I don't know, I don't like it like that, but if you like it, you do. My favorite part, the lashes. You finished? No. Then I use the Benefit Bat Gal Mascara. This is a really good one. It makes your eyelashes like longer and more dramatic. I like dramatic lashes. So you just put it here. After that, I use highlighter. I use the L'Oreal True Match Highlight, and I just put a little bit, and I just blend it with it, just a little bit. The last thing I do, the lips. I like them natural. I'm gonna be using the MAC Whirl Liner. And then I'm gonna be using the MAC Persistence. And that's it. So this is the natural look for your everyday life. I know it's not natural at all, but it's natural for me. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day and that you stay safe. I will see you next time.